I've had enough. I'm sick of seeing and touching both sides of things. Sick of being the bridge for everybody. Nobody can talk to anybody without me, right? I explain my mother to my father, my father to my little sister, my little sister to my brother, my brother to the white feminist, the white feminist to the black church folks, the black church folks to the ex-hippies, the ex-hippies to the black separatists, the black separatists to the artists, and the artists to the parents of my friends. Then I've got to explain myself to everybody. I do more translating than the UN. Forget it. I'm sick of filling in your gaps, sick of being your insurance against the isolation of your self-imposed limitations, sick of being the crazy at your holiday dinners, the odd one at your Sunday brunches. I am sick of being the sole black friend to 34 individual white folks. Find another connection to the rest of the world, something else to make you legitimate, some other way to be political and hip. I will not be the bridge to your womanhood, your manhood, your humanness. I'm sick of reminding you not to close off too tight for too long. Sick of mediating with your worst self on behalf of your better selves. Sick of having to remind you to breathe before you suffocate your own fool self. Forget it. Stretch or drown. Evolve or die. You see, it's like this. The bridge I must be is the bridge to my own power. I must translate my own fears, mediate my own weaknesses. I must be the bridge to nowhere but my own true self. It's only then I can be useful.